Logan, have you seen the Monroe file? No, Sam. It's right here, milk toast. Right in front of you. Oh. Sorry, Sam. Sorry, Sam? Hey, you look bored. Here's something to do. Sorry to interrupt, Logan. Mr. Wiedemeyer, I was just uh, finishing up here. I think you haven't even started, Logan. I think you need to redo every one of these files and have them back by 8 o'clock in the morning. But Mr. Wiedemeyer... I think you're whining, Logan. Yes, sir, Mr. Wiedemeyer. I mean, no, sir, Mr. Wiedemeyer. All I'm saying is you work too hard. You should start playing just as hard. Come play with me Saturday night. Sam. You and me. Bottle of wine, away. go to the beach. Can't you see I'm busy? I'm not going away until you give Sam the man an answer about Saturday night. Sam the what? Sam the man. Oh, what the oh. Uh, excuse Logan? me. Wiedemeyer was looking for you. He found me. Uh, hi Karen, how's it going? Hi Logan, taking off? Yeah, I got homework. Uh, listen, I was wondering. Yes, Logan? Uh. Well, well, it's not that important. Uh, have a good night. Night, Logan. Nobody's listening. Nobody's paying attention. Read my sign! <laughs> it's Nur! Everyone must hear me! The end is near! Excuse me, sir, do you have a dollar? No, I don't have any time for you. show up as a goth girl. I'm God. I can be whoever I want. Today I was feeling a bit goth-like. <sighs> Must have been the TV dinner I had last night. Still don't get it, do you? In the third grade, you peed your pants in front of the entire class. One of the things you like to do when you're alone is stand in front of the mirror and pretend like you're Superman. One of the other things you like to do when you're alone is... All right, all right. Obviously you're some kind of mind reader, or psychic or something. <sighs> Jeez, I had less trouble with Moses and Joan of Arc. I was hoping I wouldn't have to stoop to this. Where? What? Voila! Oh! My. God. Exactly. You were one of the privileged few that got to hear that announcement. Those who heard that announcement cannot tell those who didn't hear it. Do you understand? So, as you've heard, you have one day to live. Use it wisely. One day to live. Hey guy, you got a dollar I can have? You know what? Just go ahead and take that. Oh, <laughs> not a dollar, but that'll work. Thanks. You know what? There you go, too. 
Hey, alright. You're generous, man. Might as well. What? Sweet! You're late, Logan. I think this will cost you. Did you get the files done? No, Mr. Wiedemeyer. Here they are, though. Do them yourself. What the? I think you know what this means, Logan. Oh, I have an idea. I also have an idea how a certain Mrs. Wiedemeyer would react if she ever really figured out the real reason for those Las Vegas business trips last year. Uh, Mr. Wiedemeyer would like to see you. No, he doesn't. So yeah, he make... would. Sam. Karen, I was wondering, would you do me the honor of having a long lunch with me? Harold, I've never seen you like this before. I have all this work to do. I don't think Mr. Wiedemeyer would mind. Mr. Wiedemeyer knows what happens in Vegas might not stay in Vegas. Karen? Uh, let me just grab my jacket. Oh, and you'll have to drive. Okay. Wow, I can't believe you bought out the entire restaurant just for us. Well, what the heck. Life's short. I wonder what Mr. Wittermeyer is going to think about this long lunch of yours. The problem with Wittermeyer is he thinks too much. <laughs> I'd been hoping you'd ask me out. What made you change to finally do it? Well, have you ever regretted any decisions that you've made in your life? I think everybody has. Everybody has their share of regrets. Missed opportunities, lost dreams. I think that we spend so much time regretting the past that we fail to trust the present. And I guess that's all I'm doing today is trusting the present. Speaking of the present, I definitely should be getting back. I'm gonna write my number down. And if you're really interested in getting back together again, you'd be careful not to smudge it at work. Uh, oh, uh, about work. Could you drop me off at the park? You're not going back? I really don't think Mr. Wittemeyer would mind. Wow, you have changed. Hello, Logan. Are you? You? Uh-huh. When you were 14, you loved popping your pimples in front of a mirror. See if you can hit it. All right. Well, I'm ready. How's it gonna happen? World's not ending today, Einstein. But you said there was only one day to live. You had one day to live, and you lived it. Now, what you do with the rest of your days is up to you. Oh, I get it. But I gave my car away! Here's the money you get from your race to buy a new one. My race? Well, I gotta go. I have a baseball game to rain out. People hate it when you do that, you know.